Hello. Wow, that's really spectacular with the glare from the light, isn't it? There. Oh, there's the other window, though. <laughs> Can't win. Lighting's bad. Okay, well, here we are. Clean it up. Should we review the situation? It's been a while. Tyler is 10. Tanny is... Six. Turner is five and Jilly is three. That's the situation. I'm trying to do my dishes. There's a sponge. So I'm trying to use this um this stuff. You know what it is. This stuff doesn't bubble. My husband's been doing dishes for a while, and he's been oh, there's a bug in the bottom. <laughs> what a weird place to find a bug in the bottom of the sink. He's been using that blue stuff. Been slipping. I haven't made bread. I made bread the other day, and Tyler, who's had homemade bread before, is like, Mom, we never had homemade bread before. And I'm just looked at him like, No, we totally have. Maybe we're too little to remember. We used to make it all the time. Is that annoying? Oh. Else. The garden, I have not been out there at all. It's gone to the weeds. Chickens are whole new cast members. That didn't go well last year. I had a whole bunch of learning opportunities last year. <laughs> Let's just call them that. <laughs> I tried to have... Um, three different flocks because I wanted one in the chicken coop to be my compost pile and I wanted one in the garden to be my cleanup crew and I wanted one just like out and about dragging around the yard. That didn't work. Because everybody that wasn't in the chicken coop got it. And by got it, I mean, what? Julian Twitter not eating. The waffles. Oh, do they know they have waffles? No. Will you tell them they have waffles? Okay. Thank you. Oh. We should move. I was looking into the zoning of our house and I was talking to the zoning guy and he says, you're not allowed to have any. And it, I was like, well, what does it say? What does it say? He's reading it to me. Mommy, and he says, you're not allowed to have mommy, pigs, goats, chickens, I say, cows, sheep without, without permit. I was like, oh, so I am allowed to have them. I just have to get permitted. Like, <laughs> do they, the people that are enforcing these laws or these, you know, whatever, codes, like, honestly, don't even know what they really say because I've read them <laughs> I read them before I called them so I knew what they said so when he said you're not allowed I was like really what are you that what are you allowed to have and he's like you're not allowed you're only allowed to have a cat or a dog without getting authorization from the permit the code people and uh, I was a little confused because you're not allowed to have like a snake in your house or like a one of those birds, like those inside birds. What are they? Toucans or cockatoos or whatever they are. Parakeets, whatever they are. I didn't even know. Because I have no desire to have a bird inside my house. So yeah, he said that. As soon as he said that, I knew he didn't know what he was talking about. It's alright though, because I'm on my way. 
you know? So, because I had to go down there. I had to go to the code office because we got a pool. Mommy? What? Can I have some animal crackers? Yes, hold on. I had to go get a permit for the pool. Chicken bucket. Okay, honey, thank you. Sorry. This is a story about me. Yeah. What is? Right here, hold the plates. This is Mama's plate. Well, we're just going to use it. This is Mama's plate. You're going to use it. Okay, we're just gonna use the plates. Hi, yay, I fed them. <laughs> now they're gone. <laughs> For the time being, I'm gonna do some chicken in the pressure cooker for lunch. Make some chicken salad. I bought 10 pounds of it last night and I put it in the fridge instead of the freezer and I know it might have been a mistake. But we'll have it for dinner and lunches and probably three meals and it'll be gone, right? There's six of us. It's only 10 pounds. You can keep chicken in the fridge for three days, right? I like to put it in a pressure cooker and um cook it with Italian dressing. Yum. And then, uh, we don't really have anything going on. I think we're going to go to the library. Later. There's a reading program, a summer reading program. It's been very effective in keeping my kids interested in reading. Tyler has started reading before bed, which is amazing. And Tanny and Tanner is a good reader. He's reading. He reads all the time. And then Jillian and Turner get read to a bedtime. Or yeah, bedtime. I started art journaling, taking, trying to improve my drawing skills. I posted a video of that earlier. It was just um, color on a page. Yeah. That's how it is when you don't have a lot of time. Just color on a page. Um, this is getting to be a long video. It's getting to be a long video. Okay, let's um, I'll see you in a second. Maybe at a better angle. Let's try a different one this time. Okay. Okay. See you in a minute. 